Earth has seven large areas of land called continents. They are North America, South America, Europe, Africa, Asia, Australia, and Antarctica. Earth has four bodies of water called oceans that cover most of its surface. They are the Atlantic Ocean, Pacific Ocean, Indian Ocean, and Arctic Ocean. Earth from far away. This photograph shows Earth from outer space. You can see that Earth's shape is round like a ball. Earth is very large. Because of Earth's shape, even a photograph taken from space can only show one part of Earth at a time. Showing Earth on a globe. One way to learn about something large is to look at a model or a small copy of the real thing. A globe is a model of Earth. If you spin a globe, you can see all of Earth's land and water. Look at the North Pole and South Pole on the globe. It is very cold in both of these locations. Now look at the equator. The equator is an imaginary line that divides Earth in half. The northern half is called the Northern Hemisphere. The southern half is called the Southern Hemisphere. People who live in the United States live in the Northern Hemisphere. Earth, East, and West. Another imaginary line that divides Earth in half is called the Prime Meridian. Find the Prime Meridian on the globe. The half of Earth east of the Prime Meridian is the Eastern Hemisphere. The half of Earth west of the Prime Meridian is the Western Hemisphere. Latitude and Longitude. A world map is a flat drawing of Earth. Map makers use a special grid system that helps us find the exact location of any place on Earth. This system uses two sets of imaginary lines that cross called lines of latitude and lines of longitude. Lines that run east and west are lines of latitude. Lines that run north and south are lines of longitude. Places where lines of latitude and longitude cross are absolute locations.